three, two, one. Hello, this is Mark Borges, and I am Cool Wallace. And I'm Sean Smart. Today we will be talking about air pressure and how it works. Air pressure is a way of air pressing down on a given area of Earth's surface. Barometers are the tool used to measure air pressure. Falling air pressure means stormy weather is coming. Rising air pressure means fair weather is coming. And steady air pressure means the current weather will be continued. In other news, have you heard about Novak Djokovic and Rafael Nadal at the Australian Open? <laughs> okay, um, uh, let's just forget about that. Uh, here's White Boy, and I am forward to you with barometers. Air pressure? I check that. <laughs> hey guys, it's Sauce Boss here with Koala Man. And today we are going to show you about the different types of fronts on this map. We're, we're kind of low in budget, so um, we're going to have to use this and some fingers, you know, we do ethically. And notice the map, notice the water, it's beautiful, beautiful island, Koala City, this is where it's at. So, first of all, we're going to go to Chachi City where it's very high pressure and all this wind, it's like a cold front over there. Notice the hand, we will be back with Koala Man in Chachi City! This is why I wear Adidas. Hello Mike, this is Koala Man coming from Morpho News. As you can see here, there's a cold front coming this way from the sun. So cold. Well, you see, cold front brings violent storms from bringing cooler weather. As you can see, this pedestrian right here. I, I can't feel my legs. That's why I use Hot Hands, the official sponsor of More 4 News. Hey guys, back again. And today, or this time, actually, not today, it's actually all in one day, you know. Okay, uh, we're gonna be learning about Chachi Fever. Very hot over there with the warm front. Notice other hand and it's red. And Chachi Fever right next to two volcanoes. Chachi Fever is very risky but very beautiful. And we will be viewing that later on today with White Boy. This is more foreign news here. I'm White Boy bringing you your afternoon weather update. It is so hot and humid right here, and it just stopped raining. This is what you call a warm front. I mean, like, look at it. It's so hot. Look at the trees. They shed their leaves. Back to you. Try this.
That's why I drink Gatorade. If you want a revolution, the only solution is ball. Got to ball. If you want a revolution, the only Hey guys, back again. Hope you enjoyed the nice view of Tati Fever that we reviewed with the white boy there. <laughs> Funny stuff. And um, we're back, and we're going to be talking about Koala City and Stan Horton. We have I Am Cooler Than You right in between where this H is. And the H is for high pressure. Very cool and chilly. And it's a stationary front, so it's like high rain up in there. If you can notice all these little poorly drawn circles. I don't know who did that. It wasn't me, you know. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we'll be back later on, and we're going to throw it to I Am Cooler Than You in between Koala City and San Horton. Hey, it's I Am Cooler Than You from More Floor News. This is a stationary front. A stationary front is a continuous precipitation that can almost go continuously raining for days. Still raining here. Two days in a row. It's day three. It's been raining for three days, but it's about to let up. Back to you. Back again, as always, this is Sauce Boss and Koala Man. Koala Man. <laughs> and we will be discussing Morphtown this time. Morphtown is a little bit of light rain, but not hardcore like San Horton or Koala City. Just a little right light rain. That is an occluded front. As you can see, it's kind of warm and then kind of cold. Mixed up, you know. And Morphtown. Later, I will be back. And you guys will be seeing me in Morphtown later today. Hey, it's Sauce Boss here. And as you can see, there's light rain. This is called an occluded front. It's either light rain or light precipitation of any sort. And kid, will you stop that? You're really making me mad with that rain. Sorry. Okay. Jeez. Back to you. Hey, this is more cool news. And I am more cool than you because I am more cool than you. As you can see, wind blowing over the ocean produces a current of seawater. As you can see, this is very violent. Okay, that had nothing at all. This is called a warm current. A warm current is the move of tropical equatorial latitudes to polar regions. As you can see, oh god, that's cold! That is cold, okay. Okay, as you can see, no one's gonna be hanging around here for at least two weeks, okay? Hey, wait, what, what, what's Whoa, that kid that's doing the kid. over there? What? What kid? Oh! Ah. Okay, uh, we're gonna cut that, right? That's where I wear Nike. White boy here with your more four news uh, weather update. Uh, as you can see, it's kind of kind of humid here. Like like really like like look at this. Like this is messed up. They they sent me here just so they can make me look like a fool. Like why? Why can't they send you? Like what the heck, man? This Coming live to you from PB3, we got Coach Horton, Sauce Boss, J-Dub, Ricky, and Nati, or Mr. Bacon as we like to call him. Now, if you'll look over here, can you see the tree? Yes, you can see the tree. See what the tree's doing? It's moving. Why? Because of wind. Now, if you'll recall, the sun... The sun. Everybody see that? Yeah, good. Super now, hot. the sun drives convection currents in the air. Also. The greater the difference in air pressure, the greater the wind. As you can see today, we have about a 20 mile per hour wind. So, that sun is driving that convection great. Now, global winds circle the earth in wide belts. If you don't know what that means, wide belts. Coach Horton has a wide belt, big body, okay? 
wind direction is determined with an instrument called a wind vane. If you don't know what a wind vane is, I'm pretty positive it's one of those weather vanes. Now, if you've ever seen a rooster on top of a roof and it's spinning, that's a wind vane. Pause. Now, let's elaborate on that wind vane or that weather vane if we want to go that far. Now, the wind vane arrow points to the direction from which the wind is blowing. Understand? Pause. Now, meteorology is the study of weather. Sauce boss, everybody see that? Weather. Now, an air mass is a large mass of air that has a certain temperature and it also has a certain amount of moisture. Wind speed is determined with an instrument called an anemometer. The Beaufort wind scale is 0 to 12. It relates common observations to wind speed. As you can see, we got a common observation. We got a common observation. So much wind. Look at all that wind. Oh. We're done. Look at these noobs. What are you doing? You got a clear shot on this one. There's one more. Let me get this guy. Bink. Okay, that's good. How are you guys? So, who wants to die in this pretty oh, fast river? Die. Just kidding, I take that back. <laughs> if I die, I'm gonna take you with me. <laughs> Okay. You guys remember the rules? No pushing, no pulling. <laughs> Stay five feet away from each other. We're at least five feet. Yes. Smart. Unless you want to kill yourself. There are no snakes, you little sneaks behind. <laughs> Not too much, too much, too much. Hey John, Michael, you both look sexy. Thanks, yeah, man. I'm gonna turn them off. I got the light key, so I'm going to turn off the lights while they're playing. <laughs> Such a douche. Let's go. Hey, guys.